I'm Michael Knost, a university distinguished professor in biochemistry and molecular biophysics at Kansas State University. Our main emphasis in our lab is to study insects, and we're interested in fundamental understanding of molecules in insects, the biochemistry that makes insect bodies work. We want to understand how insects detect infections by proteins that bind to pathogens, and then how those proteins stimulate responses that are carried out by other proteins that kill the pathogens, the bacteria, the fungi that are invading the insect. It may be possible to use some of those ideas to make insects more susceptible to infections as a way to decrease populations of pests. And it's also possible that the understanding we're getting about insect immunity could be used to make mosquitoes less able to transmit pathogens to humans. Insects are important just for understanding biology. There are between 2 million and 30 million species of insects. So compared with humans, for example, there are about 10 quintillion insects on the earth at any one time. And so that's about 200 million insects for each person. So insects are important to life on earth and we need to study them. We have a collaboration with chemical engineers at the University of Kansas who are interested in biomaterials. To understand the chemistry of the insect exoskeleton, which is formed of proteins of different kinds and a polysaccharide, a, a carbohydrate that's similar to plant cellulose. And those two simple materials make very interesting structures that can be hard and rigid or soft and flexible that could have applications in medicine or other kinds of technologies. In my research, we have many collaborations with scientists at other universities and institutions. We have international collaborations with other scientists studying similar problems in insects, and we work together to help use a bigger team to solve the problems. The students who work in my lab are learning how to do science. They're learning how to learn. So students who come from my lab, I hope, will have a good knowledge and understanding of how we do biochemistry and take that on to other problems that they work on in their future. We have, for my group, good facilities and good colleagues. We have a particular strength at K-State for researchers studying insects, and especially insect molecular science, so biochemistry, molecular biology. There are a lot of people doing that at K-State, so we have a good environment and group of people to interact with and work together.